This might be the most bizarre image generator out there. It can create anything with no limit on how many images you can make each day. Tons of style and guess what? It is absolutely free. How crazy is that? And to everyone's surprise, this AI image generator has a tiny little secret, which I will reveal at the end of the video. Hey everyone, welcome back to Lazy Life Hack. So without further ado, let me introduce Perchance AI Image Generator. This is the homepage of Perchance AI Image Generator. The UI looks super simple, no flashy design. Just type in your prompt, choose your art style, generate your image, and you're done. You don't have to sign up or sign in to create images, but you can if you want. Just click the login button at the top right. After signing up, it will save your image to your account so you can view them later. Just like any other image generator, it has a text box to write your prompt. Below that is a box called in the description, also known as negative prompt. It is where you include things you don't want in your image. For example, if you want a tie but not a bow tie, you can mention that. You can also add things like no close-up shot or no side shot, etc. Next to it is the art style. This is the largest art style list I have ever seen. It is crazy. From casual photo to studio Ghibli animation, illustration, 1920 photo, and the list goes on. You can try different filter with the same prompt to see the difference. To its right is a shape option. You can choose portrait, square, or landscape. The last one is how many images you want to generate at a time. The default is 6, but you can increase up to 15. At the bottom, you will see show comments and gallery. Click on that. You will see a comment box that looks like a chat room. Below that are all the images created by other users. If you move your mouse over the image, you will see which art style they use and the text prompt they put in. If you click on the text, you will see the prompt and the negative prompt used to create the image. The text prompt here are quite similar to CRAI. So I don't want to waste too much time creating a prompt. Quickly go to CRAI, grab one of the picture, copy the prompt, and come back to purchase. Paste the prompt, choose digital painting, and generate. Well, it comes out quite okay, but if you compare it with CRAI side by side, it's very, very different. The image from Purchase looks very cartoonish. In fact, all the art styles look very cartoonish, but different styles does give you different outcomes. Let's try a professional photo. Usually, professional photos look realistic, but let's see how it goes. See what I mean? And it still come out looking like an anime. And also, depending on the art style you choose, just below the prompt box, you will see three new attributes. You can use them as add-ons, and they will be inserted into your prompt. If you want to remove them, you will have to go to the text box and remove it manually. Let's try oil painting realism. This looks quite good actually. How about Studio Ghibli? This looks very nice. For those who don't know, Studio Ghibli animation is a type of Japanese animation used in famous anime movies like Totoro, Spirited Away, and Princess Mononoke. Go check them out if you haven't seen them, you won't regret it. Let's carry on. So to make it look more different, let's try a 1940 photo. Oh my god, this looks really old. Okay, one last art style. Let's try medieval. This is really good, very different from the usual art style. In my honest opinion, compared to other image generators out there, the images from Apaches aren't that high quality. They feel outdated by at least a year or two. In 2024, this kind of quality doesn't hold up. Okay, now the moment you've all been waiting for, so Purchase AI Image Generator is actually famous for another reason. They can create <coughs> pictures without any restriction. Most image generators that can do that require to pay. But here in Purchase, it is free and you can go nuts with it. So here, I'm going to remove white dress and off shoulder and add one little wall. <coughs> Let's see how it goes. You might say, hey, that's nothing. Well, it's not nothing. It is something. You can actually go crazy with it. Trust me. If you don't believe me, over here, you click Show Comment and Gallery, change the filter from PG-13 to None, click Show All and Show Image, then click OK, and all hell breaks loose. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe for more. See you in the next video. Bye.